Hi there, James from V7 here. Today I'd like to show you how to detect and read text in your images automatically. To do that, we're going to start off in the Neural Networks page right here, where you'll find a new public model called Text Scanner. Now I'm going to start by turning this on and then head back to our datasets page here, where I have a dataset that contains some text. That's this license plates one right here. In order to introduce the text scanning model to this dataset, we want to add it to our workflow as a new stage. So to do that, we're going to go to the settings page. And I've already created a workflow that contains an AI model stage in the middle. Now this is where our text scanner is going to live. And we can select the text scanner from all of our models in this drop down menu right here. In this workflow, what I'd like to do is have my uh, annotators do some pre annotation before sending their images through to the AI model, which will detect and read the text on license plates before my reviewers come in and take a look at the output of the model and the work that the annotators have done before sending these images to a complete stage. Now, once I've selected my model here, I want to make sure that I map the classes appropriately. So we have our text class from the model and we want to map that to a class in this data set. As you can see, I've got nothing right now. So let's create a new class. We're going to head to the classes area right here and we'll click create new class. Now you can create a bounding box class that's just called text. But in my case, I'm going to call this license plates and we're going to make a bounding box class. Now, two important things to call out here. We absolutely want to make sure that we add this text subtype. This is the field that's going to contain the text that the model detects. Now, another thing we can do is add an attributes class to, or subtype to this class. This way we can differentiate between handwritten and printed text. Now, once I've got my tech, my class, I'm gonna click add class right here. And now when we return to our settings page, this will be available for me to add to the model stage. Now, classes, license plates. So now for the fun part, we're going to use this AI model on some of the images in this data set. So if I click on data right here and save my changes before leaving, I have these images, all of which contain a license plate uh, on the, uh, the cards that you see right here. So these have already been assigned to an annotator. So what I can do right now is select all and move these ahead into the model stage. That's my second stage of the work. Because my model is running in the background, these should start immediately. So we can see by this icon right here that they're now in the model stage being annotated and very quickly being moved into the review stage. So let's take a look at how one of our images is doing. Let's open up this one right here. Great, so we can already see that my model has detected all of the text in the license plate and elsewhere in the image. And now my reviewers can come through and make any necessary changes to the work my annotators has done and the model uh, and the text that the model has detected. And there you have it. In a few steps, we've created a workflow that automatically text, uh, detects and reads text for us. Check out the guide below for more information and have a great day.